Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing a random video, it's not serious or anything, it's actually just kind of like a fun game. Um, I know that I've done, I think, a Harry Potter Would You Rather in the past. Um, I'm not sure how many I did, but I don't think that I ever really did a... Yeah, I don't think... This one's just like a basic would you rather, it's on BuzzFeed, it's like the most impossible questions I guess, like the ones that are the hardest to kind of see which one, you know, you're going to give up or whatever, or you'd rather do, I mean. But this is just going to be a just basic, no nothing special, no specific type would you rather. Um, Alright, so let's just get started. Okay, so the first question is, would you rather give up cheese or give up oral sex? Hmm. That's a hard one. Because it kind of depends on if it means receiving or giving or in just the whole thing. Um... That is hard. Because, I mean, if it's just, like, giving oral sex, then I don't know. Because I love giving. I don't really care about receiving, so it's not that big of a deal, but I probably have to go with, I'd rather just give up oral sex, because I don't know which type they're talking about, because I love cheese, so I don't, sorry, babe, but. I'd rather give up oral sex. <laughs> um, the second question is, oh, that wasn't a question, that was just the, oh, oh well. Um, okay, and then the, f okay, the other one is, uh, sm would you rather smell like poop and not know it, or constantly be smelling poop that no one else can smell? Seriously? Or ask people are fucking annoying around here. Um, hmm, that's a hard one. <gasps> oh my god. Okay. So, these people are fucking annoying. I hate when people do that shit. Like, get out of your fucking car and go get the person or call them. Like, are you fucking shitting me? I hate people. There's, ugh. Ugh, oh, they're so annoying. Anyway. Um,. I think I'd rather constantly be smelling poop just because, like, I already do because I have kittens, so it's nothing that. But I would, I wouldn't want to smell like poop and not know it because that would be embarrassing. So I'd rather constantly be smelling poop that no one else can smell. Answer. Um. Okay. And then the second question is, would you? Would you rather oh, oh, would you rather eat only roadkill for the rest of your life or have everyone else in the world sound like Gilbert Gottfried? Oh my god. <laughs> Obvious answer is I would rather have everyone else in the world um, sound like uh, Gilbert Gottfried. I mean, I know people say he's like out there and his voice can be like boisterous and kind of annoying, but I think he'd make me. Like, I think it would just make me laugh all the time. I mean, I think it might get annoying after a while, but there's no way in hell I'm eating roadkill. So, obviously I'm going with the Gilbert Gottfried one. Um, would you rather have taste buds on your butthole or poop through your mouth? Um... Obviously, taste buds on my butt, like, or my asshole. Why would I... What? Why would I? I would never use that anyway. I don't think I would never use that anyway. I'm trying to eat food. We would know. But I would not want to poop up my mouth. That's nasty. I hate vomiting. So, ew. Um, okay, well, I guess I'd rather have taste buds on my ass. Um, would you, number four, would you rather have to say everything on your mind or never be able to speak again? 
Um, well, as you guys know, I already say everything that's on my mind, so that one, obviously, I would never want to shut up. <laughs> Even though people want me to, which I really don't care. <laughs> um, so yeah, I'd, rather, I'd go with, I always have to say everything that's on my mind. Even if it hurts people. I don't think I can go without talking, so. Sorry. Um. Um, would you rather be itchy for the rest of your life or be sticky for the rest of your life? Oh my god, ew, ew, ew. Oh, oh my god. Ew. Both of those fucking suck. But, I don't know. I hate being sticky. And I, oh my god, I'm just kidding. No, okay, look. I used to work at Fright Dome, and so, there, um, the one year that I had to wear, like, this fake blood, I think both years I actually had to... But with the zombie, I had to wear fake blood, like, more often. And that was my second year. And that shit was made out of maple fucking syrup. And that shit had to go all over my face. And sometimes it would go down my fucking neck into my tits. And that shit was disgusting. Like, that, I don't know why, but it made, it just, oh my god, it gave me so much anxiety. I don't know why I did, I just did not like it. I didn't realize I didn't like it until I started working there. And I was like, fuck that shit. I mean, I love working there. I just was like, fuck the blood thing. So I, I'd probably have to go, I'd rather be itchy. I know it would be annoying, but I'd rather be itchy. Fuck that. And people like my girl that have eczema already understand that, so it's fine. I could just use this cream. Fuck it, whatever. Wow, only 46% of people said be itchy. Y'all are nasty bitches. No, I'm just kidding. Okay. Um, let's see. Number six. Would you rather eat a bowl of vomit or lick a hobo's foot? Oh. Mmm. That makes me, like, gag. Y'all know how I feel about vomit. I mean, well, maybe. Maybe. Okay, but if you don't know, I, I hate vomiting. Like, I, I oh. Even the word makes me want to, like, do that. But anyway, um, no, I, I'd rather lick a hobo's foot. It would take, like, literally two seconds. Where, like, eating a bowl of vomit would take, like, longer. And I hate vomit, so I'd rather lick a hobo's foot. It would be disgusting either way, but, yeah. Okay, number seven. Would you rather go through life with a perpetual cold sore on your mouth or go through life with a booger hanging from your nose? Ooh, I hate that feeling. Like, I'm always checking my nose. Like, I think it's, like, an OCD thing because, like, I'm always checking my nose, like, making sure that, like, like, if you guys see me rub my nose in, like, videos all the time, it's because I'm always making sure I don't have booger because I'm so afraid of, like, having a booger in my fucking nose. Um, so, and I'm always, I always have cold sores. I mean, I'm not gross. Like, trust me, I'm not gross. I just, hereditarily, I guess, I just get cold sores more than, than other people. I don't know why I just do, so yeah, but I'd rather have a cold sore because I already have them, so whatever. And I hate boogers, so yeah. Okay, number eight, would you, oh, Jesus, oh, only, wow, that was a tie, that was close. 53% of people said the cold sore, 47 people said the booger. I don't get you, 47 people, 47% 40, 47 people, I don't understand you. Okay, number eight. Would you rather watch your parents have sex for every day for the rest of your life or join in once to stop it? That is disgusting. I mean, I know I like that shit in porns, but like, ew. That's really gross, bruh. It's so gross. <laughs> um, you know what? I'm gonna skip that since my mom watches that. Yep. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys, because either answer is just disgusting, so I'm, I'm, I'm good. I'm going to skip that. I can't answer that. I, I'm not answering that one. Okay. Let's see. Number nine. Would you rather smell your eggs when you burp or have a green cloud appear when you fart? Well, 
both already happened. I'm just kidding. Uh, you know what? I'm gross and I'm totally a dude. So I, I'd rather like have green cloud appear when I fart because I think that would be cool. Like that's me. That's me. I'm disgusting. Like I'd rather see that. And sometimes my 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 breath actually smells like rotten egg bread. I'm gross. But anyway, so yeah, I'd rather have I just think it would be cool. I mean, whatever. I mean, entertain. Hello. My whole room. The how much I fart, my entire room would be greened out though. I'm just saying it'd be gross. But anyway. So yeah, I'd I'd pick that one. The um the green fartness. Wow, only like 30% of people. <laughs> well, at least you know if I fart in public, because then you'd see it. But anyway, um, would you rather have hiccups for the rest of your life or always feel like you have to sneeze but not be able to? Oh my god, oh my god. Oh, you guys don't understand how much I hate both of those. Fuck. So much. I hate both of those, like, so much. Hmm. I feel like this one's gonna be a close call because I feel like both of those are irritating for everyone. So I feel like it's gonna be both. I don't even know. I I I'd probably have to go with the sneeze because hiccups irritate me and they hurt. Like okay, not being able to sneeze kind of it hurts, but not as much hiccups like for me personally. So I'd probably have to go with the sneeze one. Yeah, sixty nine percent of people said the sneezing. Kinky mother, I'm just kidding. Okay. Um, see, is this the last question? No, nope, it's not. Of course not. Okay. Number eleven. Would you rather? Would you rather only be able to listen to Nickelback songs, or reread all fifty-six pages of iTunes terms and conditions every day for the rest of your life? Uh, Nickelback. I actually like Nickelback. I don't understand the hate. I'm not, like, obsessed with them, but I don't hate them. I actually like their music. Like, I don't, I just don't, I, I don't understand the hate that people have. Like, how can you hate Far Away? That shit makes me cry, like, all the time. Like, the fuck? But anyway, yeah, I, I would go with Nickelback songs. I mean, I, I wouldn't want to listen to just Nickelback songs, but I'd rather just listen to Nickelback songs instead of reading. That would hurt my fucking eyes. Like, fuck that shit. Um, fuck that. So, yeah, I'm going Nickelback. Why is that so close? Why? Why is that so close? That is so sad. What the fuck, people? 56% and 44. Y'all are just weird. Anyway. Okay, number 12. Would you rather live like a king but have no friends or family or be homeless, homeless with your friends? Homeless. Ah. Jesus Christ. With your friends or family. That's hard because um, I don't really have family. I mean, I do, but I don't talk to them and I really don't give a shit about them. I mean, my parents, but I, I, I wouldn't, I wouldn't want those two together around. Um, <laughs> I mean, I'd more so want my mom with me than my girl, but. I don't, I don't think I'd want to be homeless, though, with them. I feel like that would suck. Because I'd get hungry and probably eat everything, you know? I'm sorry, but I'd rather live like a king. I know that's fucked up and completely conceited. But, I mean, if I could have at least, like, my mom and my girl there, I, I, I think I'd be fine. I don't know. I think I'd be okay. I, I'm good. If my daughter was still alive, her too. I'm, I'm just gonna go with the king one because I, I can't be homeless like I, I don't oh I don't do that I don't do that bullshit wow, only 27% y'all are motherfucking liars just letting y'all know 73% said be homeless yeah yeah half y'all lying just trying to lurk lurk but anyway okay would you rather eat a potato and feel its pain or be a potato I'd rather be a potato. I'm already a potato. I'm already a fucking big ass goddamn holy potato. 
I don't think I can eat a potato and hear its pain because if it screams, I will literally be triggered so much. Like, I, I hate that. I hate the sound of screams. So, I, I think I'd be a potato. I'm already, I'm already halfway there, so. Worst. Thirty percent be a potato. Y'all are sick. Just saying. Rude. Like, you, you don't want to hurt a potato? That's just, that's just me. Okay, number 14, I don't know how many fucking questions there are, I don't even know, but, okay, number 14, um, would you rather have vaginas that is, or have penises of fingers? Well, I mean, it depends, because, I don't know. Because, like, if I have a vagina on my ear, or have a vagina on my ear, like, would it get hairy? Because if it does, like, I'm not sure with that, you know what I mean? Um, but I wouldn't want to have penises for fingers because then I would have to make them hard to use them. <laughs> so, I mean, that's, I, I don't know, I, I think probably vaginas, but, I, I, I'd rather have vaginas. I mean, I'm okay with vaginas. It's just me. 64% penis and vaginas. And probably most of the 64% are probably men. Just so they can finger their ear. God, I'm disgusting. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Number 15. Would you rather have sex with a goat and no one would know? Or not have sex with a goat but have everyone think you did? Um, I, I'd rather not have sex with a goat and have everyone think I did because, um, yeah, I don't want to have sex with a goat. <laughs> and if people know, I mean, who cares? If they, if they think that I did, I mean, rumors are everywhere now in the society, so it's not like it's really any different. So, yeah, I don't want to have sex with a goat. Number 16. God, I don't know how many videos are on here. Would you rather pry your thumbnail off with a fork or put a toothpick under your big toenail and kick a wall? Oh, girl. Hmm. Both of those make me so much cringe. Like they, they make me cringe so bad. I don't, I don't, I don't like it. I don't like it. I'm not doing the wall. Nope. I'm getting visuals of how that would feel and look, and I don't like it. I'd rather pry my fucking thumbnail off with a fork. I mean, if it came down to it, I wouldn't do either. I would just cry like a little baby. But in this game, I I'd rather pry my my fucking thumbnail off with a damn fork. I don't I don't think it'd be any less painful. But there's no way I'm kicking a fucking wall with a goddamn toothpick and under my toenail. Like, fuck that shit. Fuck. So, I think the pry of my thumbnail would work. Yeah, 59% of the people said that. Ooh, okay. And number 17. Oh, here we go. Here's the last one question. Would you rather know when you're going to die or how you are going to die? I honestly wouldn't want to know because then I'd always be paranoid like if I knew how I was gonna die I mean the thing is, is like you know if this whole thing of you know you die if you if it's actually your time to go then it's your time to go you know what I mean so it's kind of like if I knew how I was gonna die either way it's like you can't really avoid it like if you know so either way you're already paranoid as fuck but, I don't know. I think I'd rather know how, maybe. I don't want to know either. Um, maybe how? Because if I know when, then I think I'll be more paranoid. If I knew how. Because at least if I knew when, at least if I knew how, like, I wouldn't know when it was going to happen, so, like, 
like I would know how it would happen, but I wouldn't be like trying to kind of beat the clock, I guess, because I would I wouldn't know. I would be like, I don't know when this is gonna happen. God, I think I'm putting too much thought into this shit. But anyway, I'd probably say how. Yeah, fifty-eight people. Um, that is it. Those are all the questions. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys want to do the quiz, um, it's on, it's just, it's BuzzFeed. Uh, it's like 17 would you rather impossible questions or some shit like that. Um, so you guys can check it out if you want to do it. I mean, fuck. <laughs> it fucked me up a little bit. Yeah, um, yeah. Well, hope you guys enjoyed the video and I will see you guys later. Bye.